stuff. I didn't really change anything. Thank you to everybody that's been hanging out in the chat before I even started going live. Um, yeah, this morning's been a little hectic. I am now going to play some video games as a way to get, get some, um, some mm, 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 tranquility. How's everybody doing? Let me know how your day is going while I tweet out about being live. I am live playing Abnimal Crossing. Twitch.tv slash FSM2. I spelled it so right. Everyone who has, has notifs on is like, wow, that was, so, that was so good. Let's go over to, to Instagram. Hello, everybody. Ooh, uh, oh, I look so ugly. I had to retake that. Yuck. Ew. Ew, gross. Didn't really like that. And I did not enjoy that. Hello, everyone. Okay, I took a selfie. I am live. Not love. I am live. Not trying to get uh, killed and murdered in you. Da -da 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 -da. Um, Twitch dot tv slash mxm tune mxm tune playing animal crossing swipe up animal crossing i have a couple things i want to do today i think that we can get them done twitch twitch dot tv i need to have the stream up on my my laptop that way i can that way i can Make sure everything is going smoothly. Sorry. I'm a little behind on setup today because I, um, I don't know. I woke up really late today. I tried an eyeshadow look that looked really ugly, so I didn't like it. I called with my boyfriend for a tiny bit, and then I had a lot of work things I needed to do. So, um, yes, things are, things are going okay. Let's go here to stream manager. Here we go. Perfect. Lovely. Excellent. Wow. Never used stream manager. Oh, I could see all of my followers. Usually I just check it on the refresh page. Okay, everybody. Let's do it. I, uh, we're going to play a game today. I might play Smash at some point. I think that, um, oh my gosh. Oh, right. Oh my God. There's a faint counter now. So do I, should I make a tarantula island today? So that way, um, I can faint and then we can have a faint counter. Should I do it? Okay, we'll figure it out. We'll do, we'll play, um, uh, oh, you just saw me cycle through all of my different setups. That was really embarrassing. Sorry. I usually have a, I, I forgot to click. Okay, everything is okay now. I can't hear my alert box, which is so weird because you guys can hear it, but I can't hear it. And I want to be able to hear it. Alert box. Oh, well. Whatever. I'm sorry if I don't notice if people sub. I just be vibing. Just be vibing, you know? Let's close this guy right here. Sorry, I'm like very distracted today. Let's play. I'm not going to play Just Dance. Oh, okay. Let me reset the time real fast. Uh... <laughs> uh, I'll do Just Dance on another stream. Maybe this Sunday I'll do Just Dance. Sorry, I'm a month ahead. Wait. Is this the actual date today? What is the date? Someone tell me. Uh, 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 why, why are you on Twitch so relaxing? Is it March 31st? Okay. Okay, 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 okay. But. But. I requested a customization on my house. And if I go backwards, I don't think it gives me the, the finished product. And I would really like to upgrade my house a second time today. Fine, I'll play on the actual date. Fine, I'll play on the actual date. Jesus. Such fool followers. SMH. Cheater. Yeah, okay, I told... Okay, the title of the stream is Yes, I do time skip. Yes, you can. You can flame me for it. I told you. I will accept the roast. It's fine. Go forward and then backwards. Look at them. They are so cute. They are so cute. I love my ugly children. 
my cute and ugly children. We have 400 viewers today. Oh, don't pick your nose, Maya. Don't do that when you have 400 viewers. Yikes. 400 viewer stream. It says mine's not updated. It says I have 451 viewers. Oh, never mind. I have 416. Thank you, everybody. That's really fun. Okay, we're gonna change our outfit because we in about this. Last time on the stream, we did this really cool, nice renovation to the house. I really quite enjoy it. Um, it looks so nice in here. It looks very good. Okay, going in here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I wonder if we can get... Is, is 11,000 too ambitious for this stream? 11,000 followers? Can I put a follower goal on here? Do you think that I can do that? Wait one second. Follower goal. It's gonna look really ugly. <laughs> goal about. I don't wanna, this is, this is too much. It looks so ugly. I'm gonna worry about this later. We'll, we'll make it cute on another stream. Okay, let's see. We're gonna make our character cute. You think I'm really pretty and cool? Thank you. Oh, thanks for joining the stream. Okay, let me let me make it nice in here. My room is really nice. We worked on this last time we were playing Animal Crossing on my stream. Um, and I think it looks really good. Okay, let's let's dress this girl up. She's wearing some Crocs right now. She looks great. We've got a sushi outfit honestly love this vibe the rice it just looks really good my i don't know if you remember this but the little bamboo amv was naruto amv and it was uploaded back in 2018 i think that qualifies you as a soundcloud rapper that is my only goal in life is to be a soundcloud rapper so thank you oh man what should we what should we do drip or drown everybody i don't actually have that many clothes now that i think about it let's just dress her up as an e-girl i think that's nice and easy oh my god we could get little love this for her okay we don't have like a cute skirt though i think this is probably the closest but that whole this fit looks disgusting if that's what it looks like ew oh disgusting disgusting ew hate this let's just make her goth that's the easiest way to do this Ooh love this we could also do a full length dress with pearls but i think that the vibe is like a little too oh yeah yeah i love these glasses too i think they look so cute hmm there is no chain unfortunately everyone i really like these little tiny shoes they're really cute and then i think that i wish i had like an e-boy hat We'll go check, oh, I didn't save. We're gonna go check Mabel and Sable's store. My mic is a little quiet. Should I just talk really close to the mic like this? I can't really fix it, otherwise it blows out the, here, let me go, let me go here. If I go I like this, is that slightly better? I can push it closer to me too. I'll do this all in ASMR, ASMR. special and it just says mx <laughs> i love that thank you so much doing a really bad job asmr honestly uh not to flex but it it requires a very distinct kind of voice meow 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 mic is fine if you turn up the volume all the way it's fine okay great news this mic causes me a lot of problems. Don't enjoy it a whole lot. It's great for recording music when I can mix things, but for streaming and stuff, I don't know how it works. This is really cute. We're gonna buy it. <laughs> Not gonna lie, Animal Crossing voice is kind of a bot. It's got a good, got a good cadence to it. Good beat. One thousand nine hundred bells. Wait, let's check their wallpaper and flooring selection. And their flowers. Let's see. Blah, 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 blah. I really want, like, that's cute. I really want, like, roses or tulips. Groovy wall. 
Ooh. Yes, I'll buy it. I think we need to make a bath. Oh, thank you for the sub, Zesty. Okay, let's really vibing with this too. I'll buy it. It's really nice to be rich as fuck in a game, you know? We're gonna make a tarantula island and we're gonna ball out some more today too. I bought the cliffscaping kit too as well. So uh, yeah, I'm excited about that. I don't really, I okay, I go on TikTok sometimes and I watch all these Animal Crossing videos where people are like, their towns are so pretty and it looks like they programmed it with a computer. I don't know how you have the patience to do that to your whole entire village. I don't know how I could just not, I could not do it, but I'm gonna try. I a football hat, a football hat, a monocle. Oh my God, okay, let's go in here. My nose is running guys. Pray for me. 100, 458 viewers. Sorry, my nose is runny. I can't. Ugh. Ugh. I don't have tissues. Oh, this is actually really cute. It's really cute. That's really cute. What? Ah, oh, wait. Hunter has his hat. <laughs> They have nightgowns? Okay. A gold monocle. Oh, I forgot I got stung by bees. Well, there you can see it now. Why did I just realize that? Because I was wearing cool glasses. Flower tights. We can get a chonkless. Yes. Oh, thank you for the, be the, the bits, Nana. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Da, da, da. I get really sidetracked. Playing Animal Crossing is bad for my brain because I get really distracted very easily. Kimi dress. Oh, I can't get over it. She looks so sad and puffy. That's what I look like when I wake up in the morning. Oh! I love this hat. Okay, so we're getting this hat. Let's see, we're gonna make a whole new fit here. Um, um, no. We're gonna make her like a goth. Yes, yes, ah. Uh, business shoes. Oh, she looks so classy. Okay. Oh my God, 500 viewers. Thank you, everybody. Wow, that's really scary. Not gonna think about it too hard. Ugh, the monocle's disgusting. It's okay. Ah, look at those glasses. Woo! Yes, chef's kiss. Chef's kiss. Let's see, they don't have an oversized hoodie, but I think the t-shirt dress is a good vibe though too. I wish they had this in black. Like, why don't they have it in black? Okay. Ooh. Is that a vibe? No. This is the vibe. This is the vibe. Okay, this is great. This is a $5,000 outfit. Uh -huh -huh. Look at this queen. Look at her go. Look at her go. Ay, ay. Yeah, yeah. Yes, yes. Ay, yeah, yeah. Okay. My nose is so ready. Look. Ah. I need toilet paper, but we must spare it for the bottoms. Sorry, why did I say that? Nobody wanted to hear that. I'm gonna leave now. Wait, no, no. No, let me get back, let me get back in. Let me back in, let me back in. Let me back in, let me back in, let me back in. Let me in. Let me in. I need to talk. Oh, no, 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 no. Hi. Hi, Sable. <laughs> okay, girl, that's fine. One day you'll talk to me. Let me in. You're a very good vibe. Thank you. Are you gonna make me cry? Don't make me cry. Look at our neck beard.
electric chair, electric chair, electric chair. <laughs> I'm actually gonna cry. At least Timmy and Tommy won't judge me. Uh, the neck beard gold is ugly. Uh, see, they don't they don't judge. They just sell you things. Okay, let's get medicine. I ran out because I was kind and I gave it to Sid last time. Do 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 do. In bulk, bro. He just insulted my vibe. Wait, no, no, that's plenty. This is enough. This is much enough. Enough. This is okay. Okay. Fine, since this ugly, ugly man wants to comment on the way that I look as a woman. Take medicine. Blow your nose, Maya, and wash your hands. Fine, fuck, I'll go get some tissue, damn. Damn. I don't have, okay, wait, hold on. I have paper towel. Ugh. I just wiped off all the makeup on my face. Legend, legend, legend. Ah! Um, um, Maya made a full song of dying on an island. You did? Oh my gosh. Money? Okay, money spot. We're gonna make a bell tree right here. It. Ah. God damn it. Let's go. 1,000 bells, that's nothing. Let's plant them. Can you plant like 10,000 bells? Ah! <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Is that, is that, is this the guy that on TikTok that does that? Yes, sir. 516 viewers. Oh, thank you for the bits again, Nana. Wait, okay, my alert thing is really annoying and it's not actually in the right spot. We're gonna fix this. Oh, no, wrong. Let's put that back where it was supposed to be. My alert box, sorry everybody. I'm like a very professional Twitch streamer, as you can tell. Transition, there we go, there we go. Let's make it a little smaller. Let's make it a little smaller so it doesn't disturb. Okay, cool. Ah 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 ay, 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 ay. Okay, we're gonna what did we get here? Oh, this was like I was playing last night. Ooh, wait, I wanted to see what the flooring looked like. Other way, other way, other way. Get it out, get it out, get it out. I don't care. This one. Oh my god. This place is sick as heck. Wait, okay, how do you get rugs? I really need a, a rug. What was I doing? I was gonna do so many things today. That's because I was gonna wait. Okay, here, let's go. Let's see, I need to put them some things in storage. Put in storage, put in storage, put in storage. I think our best use of time right now would be going to the island. I don't know if I have enough tickets though. Um, but I think that we can make a tarantula island. I just need enough tickets, which is very frustrating. Oh my god, this takes so long. Sorry, everybody. Tree branches, put in storage. Board game. Sid just gave me a board game the other day, and I want to see what it is, what it looks like. This is the ugly room. I'm really sorry. 
fucking disgusted. At least it has bops though. It's so safe to sleep with a hammer right above your head. In the MXM Tomb stream, we practice safety. Okay, let's make this place a little cleaner. I don't like this room. I think it looks ugly. I don't know if I like the wallpaper though either. That doesn't make it any better though either. Honestly, I think that this record player has got to go. We're gonna make it centrally green themed. Let's add some like, like a mantis into this room or something. A bug. A board game. The mantis can get uh, sugar cubes. No, that was wrong. Ugh! Frick. Let's place the moss ball. Moss ball, come here. Over here. I think this is the game room now. It's getting better. It's slowly getting better. I need to see if I can have a shelf. Do I have a shelf here? Um, no. Do we dare use a cardboard box? I have so much- okay. I get so into the interior design aspect of all games and known to mankind to have any sort of form of personalization or customization. And, um, I just- I could sit here and do it for hours. I have done it for hours with like The Sims and with Animal Crossing. Funny story, I just gave my mom, we're gonna use a cardboard box. I know that's like frowned upon, but like just let me live in peace. What's in here? Oh, we have a waste bin? That's kind of cute. We're gonna put that over here. I gave my mom recently my 3DS, so that way she could have, um, the opportunity to play Animal Crossing New Leaf because she really likes Pocket Camp and we don't have a, another Switch for her to play on until my brother and I are done playing Animal Crossing. <laughs> so we, I wanted to let her to see if she liked the actual gameplay because I think Pocket Camp and Animal Crossing are actually very different. But um, she really likes it. I think plays it every free moment she has. Okay, let's see. We're gonna... The cardboard box is not that hideous, all right? I just wanted to put that out there. Did I place that? No, that was horrendous. There we go. We're gonna move this over here. Right there. And we're actually gonna put this guy over there. This already looks so much better. Da, 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 da. That looks like a little craft corner now. That's cute. That's really cute. This whole stream is very quiet. I'm very sorry. I wish that there was like a master volume adjuster thingy that I could use, but there is not. Unfortunately. We're gonna put a breaker over here because I guess every house needs to have that. Um, let's see. 
Speaking of moms, before I got there, I spent 20 minutes trying to help my mom set up a Zoom meeting so she could share her screen because she has a course meeting. 20 minutes. I love her, but 20 minutes. 20 minutes is a lot. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, I think there's like... I could put my baby chair in here. Baby chair. Baby chair. It's kind of cute. It is a little bit cute. Baby chair. We could put an open fire. Is that too dangerous? We could put a toilet. Let's place a toilet on the beach in honor of Marco. Ceramic toilet. That room is a little cluttered, but it's like a cute kind of cluttered. Like you want to hang out in there type vibe, you know? This room is immaculate. It is so good. So fresh. We have a new clock for this room, too. I'm so excited. So excited. Ugh. The, the sound of uh, being able to hear the, um, the stove going is so nice. Got a whole fucking clock. It's reflective and shit, too. Oh, my God. Look at this. Our emo queen living her best life. Let's put this guy in storage over here. All right, we're leaving. We're zooming. Ooh, it's such a cute space. I really want, I'm gonna take inspiration from my Animal Crossing place and then, oh baby. I am such a simp for stitches. I am such a simp. Look at him. Oh, they are waving to each other. Not you, cat. Stitches, say hi to me. Stitches! You're doing so well. Fuck. God damn it. He's so cute. Wait, I want to talk to him. Cat, talk to me. <laughs> I want to chat. Flick was here last night and I sold a tarantula to him for 18,000 bells. Oh wait, I think Flick is here now then. Because I went back a day. If we could get a bunch of tarantulas and then sell them up to Flick... Okay, how many miles do we have right now? Oh, 400. I have to yike. I have no way of getting more miles. I need 2,000 in order to get a Nook Miles ticket. Oh God. Oh my God, what do I do? Oh no. I'm gonna be too broke. Um. See, it's 2000. And then. Uh, man. Fuck. Shit. Don't ask me what I be on. Who I be on. Uh. I. I know. Ow. I already know how to make any island a tarantula island, so I know how to do that, but I just don't have any ways of getting more miles because I've completed so many of the tasks. Hi, Pete. Oh, that's so cute. That's so cute. That shit is so cute. Okay, wait. I... Is Flick here? He buys these guys for a lot. Nook uses financial drain. It is very effective. Don't send me Nook Miles tickets. I really want, okay, I I want to catch tarantulas, but I don't have enough, um, I don't have enough freaking Nook Miles to go to a Nook Island. 
give us your ASMR. This is my ASMR voice. Thank you so much, Hiromi Moromo, for, um, I want to sit with you. For the sub. <gasps> Don't! girlfriend no <laughs> she just got up and left ow okay I really what is Stitches doing now he's still going this, this boy entertains himself so much um what was I gonna do I have to find ways of making more nook miles I could do all of these like I guess the only way to do it is to do these boring mundane tasks. I can't catch a football fish until it's later, but I can chop some wood, I think. Let's do that. Let's chop some wood. Hold. Sorry guys, this is gonna be very boring for a little bit. It probably could be boring for the whole thing. We have no idea. No way of knowing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, gimme gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme a man after midnight. Fun fact, Mamma Mia was my favorite um, movie growing up. It's just, there's something about Meryl Streep and ABBA. Something about it. Let me, let me in! Let me in, okay. Did you hear Tom Nook isn't actually a raccoon? Yes, he's a tanuki, I think is what it's called. It's like a Japanese, is it a Japanese demon? Cause I know that a cap, cap is a Japanese demon as well. Mamma mia, here we go again. My, my, it just how much I missed ya. Mamma mia, does it show again? Why, why? I got all those lyrics wrong, un, un, undubitably, indubitably. Maya, you've mama your last Mia. <laughs> Tanukis are real animals? Are there Japanese raccoon dogs? Wait, I need to look this up. Tanuki. I'm also gonna order food while I'm on stream, everybody. Sorry about that. I haven't eaten lunch yet. Tanuki. I just looked up a city in India on accident because I misspelled it so bad. <laughs> oh my god! What? Everyone, look this up. Look at this shit. Are you seeing this? Look at it. What is that? So cute though. Oh my gosh. Why it look like that? You know, Tom Nook made them seem like they would be a lot thicker than they actually are. <laughs> they, he made them seem a lot thicker than they actually are. Let's see it. We have to catch five fish. Let's go catch five fish. Uh -huh. I just did this in the most horribly roundabout way. Give me. I, if you should know anything, I'm actually horrible at fishing. I don't know why. I just, like, I cannot. I also have to do it by closing my eyes because if I don't close my eyes, I, like, press A way too fast. I, I know, PETA tweeted at me the other day because I said that Tiger King is wild on Netflix, and it is. Okay, has anybody else watched Tiger King? Joe Exotic? Freaking crazy story. Like, I can't believe that that stuff happens in this world. This is going to be a freaking sea bass. I know it. I have to close my eyes. I wasn't expecting it to already grab on. Okay, watch Tiger King if you haven't watched it already. It is the wildest ride. Orange wall. And I tweeted that it was crazy. Also, apparently one of my followers is like, Joe Exotic is their uncle. I don't know what to say about that. That was wild too. Ah, frick. I am absolute trash at this game. 
Come here. Come here, fishy, fishy. Ah! I did it. I freaking did it. I knew I was going to do it, too. Okay. Here. No, what? You were facing that way. Okay. Ah! A gay redneck that breeds tigers is definitely crazy. It's... I... a oh, freaking red snapper. It's... Uh, ooh, uh, uh, uh. I still haven't finished paving this part of the path. I thought the butterfly shadow was a fish. I really do be the dumbest person alive. Let's go over here. Look it! She's fishing! There's no fish! Sweet girl! Okay. I don't know about you, but I am a gay redneck that breeds tigers. His presidential campaign video, if you look up Joe Exotic's presidential campaign video, it is a wild ride. Yes, I am gay. That's one of the lines. That man is a trip. Whole trip. Yes, I am gay. You aren't the dumbest person alive because I came here on 3 p.m. EST confused as to why you weren't on stream yet. I only stream at 3 on Tuesdays and Fridays. Tuesdays and Fridays. This is going to be a sea bass. If I could freaking land this. Oh, he was ready. Oh my god. My depth perception is just atrocious. Oh my gosh. Nobody look at this. This is like parallel parking, but Animal Crossing's edition, where it's just like the witnesses are the worst part. You're not even embarrassed by your own job, it's just how many people are bearing witness to it. I will, I will, I will single-handedly wipe out the existing population of sea bass if I have to catch another one. I will go on a murder spree. PETA's gonna find this video and be like, Jesus Christ, why did we tweet at her? What? Oh my gosh. Parallel parking but Animal Crossing. Am I wrong? <laughs> Am I wrong? Oh my god. Okay, so I still need to catch more fish because... Apparently I suck ass at this. We still need to catch one more fish. We also ran out of our, I can't remember what a fishing pole takes. I know that it's softwood, I think is part of it. Tree branch and iron nugget. Okay, let's go back to our sick pad. I love you on your music. I can't really, I can really relate to a vibe to even. I really can't really, I can really relate to and vibe to. And even if you can't catch fish, you're very sweet. Thank you, I'm sorry, I also can't read. It's so fun to be illiterate. What's up, my young gunna? I love how you're subtly annoyed during most of the stream. I'm just tired. I think quarantine's really getting to me. Can I just be serious for a second? Quarantine is hard. I feel very lucky that I'm able to do my job, but I'm also going a little bit insane. Like, I might paint my door because I don't know what else to do with myself. Like, I don't know if that's... It's not wild or anything, but geez, I am gonna go nuts. I don't have any routine right now, which is something that I have to figure out for myself, but like, it's rough, guys. It's rough. I am an introvert, and I love doing nothing, so I will be totally fine for the remainder of however long I need to do this, but ugh, I am fighting the urge to dye my hair, too. I have leftover purple hair dye shampoo that I could just easily wash my hair with and then my hair would come out being really purple because it's still now somewhat blonde. But getting back to this took me so long that if I just ruined it, it would be sad. And also, like, I think about my hair kind of like a K-pop star, as in eras. Like, this next era of music has to have a look attached to it and the purple hair era was for the masquerade. I wish I had pink dye so I could, like do a pink tinted hair look for myself, you know? Am I crazy? Ugh. My elbows, I mean my shoulders just pop. <laughs> I am done for now. We need to, I need to, um, 
Like, maybe I can just live vicariously through my Animal Crossing character. I saw someone on TikTok who used foundation and then put that in her hair and then patted eyeshadow on the streaks. And I was kind of intrigued by that idea. Because then, like, you know... Oh, I don't know if my stream is lagging or not. Oh, I think it's okay now. Refresh your screens, everybody. Everything okay? Okay, everything is all good now. Yeah, it's all good. I can like maybe live vicariously through my Animal Crossing character dyeing her hair, but this is also very not much, not adequate. Extremely inadequate, in fact. Depends on your definition of okay. Well, yes is okay. That's not where the fish is. I am stupid. Come on, come on, come on. Fish. Closing my eyes. That's the only way I can do it. The music could be quieter. Thank you for your feedback. I will turn it down. I've turned it down slightly. I... We did it. We got 150 miles. Ugh, this is such a slow grind. Okay, we are selling fruit now. That is our next task. I run very aggressively in Animal Crossing and I know that it is very stressful to people because I just zoom through these flowers like they don't, they don't exist. Her character looks like she's having an emo phase. She is, don't judge her. Okay. Let's see, what else do we have to do? I think we might need to sell things for 5,000 bells. So, earn bells by selling items. So we need to, I think we might be able to get to 5,000 bells with our current selection of things inside of our inventory. Let's see. Make the subscriber donating sound the fish ta taking that bait, please. Maybe. It's actually a cute idea. But I made all of the ukulele chimes for all the things on, on my Twitch alerts, so I'm very emotionally attached to them. Want to sell? Let's see. Here's what I'm offering. Would you like this? And a tiger beetle. You can take these. I tried baking the whipped coffee that you see all over TikTok. It's a fucking lie. Couldn't whip it. My arm got tired after five minutes. 10,000 bells, bitch. Okay. We're rolling in it. Oh, oh. I will play Smash after this probably because I feel like Animal Crossing, I'm now at this point where I am, I've, I didn't speed run it. Okay, I did speed run it because I time skipped. You can flip me for it. But like, I just need some variety, you know? I need to, to switch up the flavors. Maybe I need to play one game of Just Dance just so you guys can laugh at me. Mm -hmm. I haven't played Just Dance in a really long time. I think I might get copyrighted though too. We have to hit some rocks. We have to sell a hot item for a fortune. Spend bells to buy items. Okay, what's the hot item? Wooden block stereo? What does that take? You know we can definitely make it. Oh yeah. Ba, 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 ba. Softwood. Okay. We have all of those things that we need. Hi Flick! Wanna date? <laughs> okay! <laughs> My, I've made whipped coffee multiple times. You might just be weak. Okay, Lucy. I am. I know I am. I'm not afraid to admit it. I know my own strength, and that's non-existent. Do, 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 do. We need to grab some soft wood from here. I love the inventory in this game. It's so much nicer to look at. Let's craft. Uh, uh, oh, oh. Woodblock toy. Build it. Okay, I figured it out. Small Maya era is medium length. Plum Blossom era is short. Prom dress era is blonde highlights. Masquerade era is purple. 
aha uh -huh, yes and then dawn and dust era is maya having a hair crisis essentially yes remember that week where i went through five different hair colors i don't even know if some of them were visible online because i was switching them so often there was like a month in January, a month in January, the month of January. I was just having a very hard time. Uh, a discord would be so nice. We are, we will work on it, Sam. I'm thinking this week is probably when I'm gonna try and focus on some, just some Twitch things. Um, we'll work on it, don't worry. Uh, let's see what else is here. And like, okay, so I went through, one of them wasn't even actually my choice. It was for the Taco Bell ad shoot that I was a part of. They like spray painted my hair pink and then it looked kind of cool. So I just took a lot of selfies with it. And then I tried to freak people out on TikTok and it worked. I think that video got like 100,000 likes or something. Um, so that worked. And then I also think it was like tinted pink too, because I like, I used overtone like color conditioner i don't even want this this stupid crap here but let's just spend it on clothes again sorry sorry to me and tommy but yeah i just sean sean hi sean thanks for liking my house oh my god just got so excited mr wasabi ceo of all animal crossings and cute noises Sean! Can everybody put a, a yeah in chat for Sean or a something in chat for Sean? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the stream. Oh my god. A yeah. I meant the emoji, not the actual word. <laughs> The stupidity. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you for the warm welcome for Sean Wasabi, everybody. Oh my god, that was so funny. Women's... Oh, I, th I read workers as women's jacket. Ah! Oh my gosh. Wow, there's a lot of yas. Lot of, lot of hype. Thank you, everyone. Okay, let's, let's see. Let's. We're gonna make another cute outfit. We're gonna make it... Kind of off the cuff edgy, you know? Safety helmet. Ooh. Uh. Ooh, the masquerade? Ugly. <laughs> Ew. Let's do this though. I think that. What noise did I just make? I just made a really weird, like, laughing noise. Wow. Okay. These emojis, man. People are like, why well, she called us out so we have to make redemption? I think that, uh. Let's do some slip on loafers? No. Yes, slip-on loafers. We're gonna do these little tube socks because they're really cute. And I honestly, we're making an outfit around these. Oh, we could get purple, so it's like fading in. Let's do octagonal green glasses. And then we'll do, is the white hat a vibe? This hat's cute. I don't know if I like that. We'll do gray, gold then. And these tube socks could be better. So we're just gonna, like, this is cute. Don't mind my backpack. Oh, I was gonna sell the hot item. I got distracted. <gasps> oh, that's so cute. That's so freaking cute, bro. Okay, let's see. Sorry, Kiwi dress. I really wanted to like you, but I didn't. Mm -hmm. We're just wearing shorts underneath. <laughs> There's nothing going on underneath. I'm so sorry. Bit of a JoJo reference. JoJo. Pose. JoJo. Pose. I wish they had like short skirt that I could wear, but they don't. Do the guide shirt though. We need to spend 5,000 bells though, so we get in some pants or something. None of these look cute with this. Why is that so ugly? Maybe these tights. Ew. God, why? Sorry, everyone. I'm having a crisis. These vibrant shorts. Actually, that is really cute. But it's not 5,000 bells. We aren't spending enough money. Everybody, we need to spend more money. Thank you for the sub heroes. Oh, my goodness. Okay, let's see. These shoes are too cheap. 
Those look bad, though. Maybe these dress shoes? Maybe these ones? Why do they make the feet look so big? Let's see. We need to spend more money! Do I just buy slacks? It's not the worst. It's not great either. It's happening. It's just gonna happen. This is the best that we can do. This is the best we can do. Your last stream, a lot of people are dressing like their avatars in super cute dresses, but I like the shirt and pants kind of vibe. Okay, we just got an apron and pants kind of vibe, so it's still in the same sort of thing. Okay? Okay. We did it. We, we spent monies. We're trying so desperately to try and get up to 2,000. I think that we can do it. It's just gonna take so long. By tomorrow, Terry, it's B-Day. Yes, the MXM tune. Wish your happy 16th birthday. Happy 16th birthday! Harriet, which apparently I say in the most American way possible. I don't know what way you want me to say it. Harriet. Harriet. Is that how I say it? Hee hee. Hee 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 hee. Oh wait, we're gonna go sell this, this, uh, this speaker. Hold up, hold up. Sorry. Just broke character. Harriet. So, I want to sell. Oh, wait, we need to go get those fossils assessed by Blathers. Sir Blathers. I'm kind of waiting for another goal, though, to come up that was like, get, get fossils assessed. We still have 522 viewers. Thank you to everyone that's staying. Um, yeah, I'll take that. Just earn back all of our money that we spent on an outfit. Da, 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 da. Bye. 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 What was I doing now? Okay, we're gonna look at the the, the, the things that we have here. We're we're not gonna be able to catch a football fish. We could probably hit a rock. Oh, they want us to chop more wood. Let's hit a rock instead. Let's go hit a rock. Do, do, do. Ah, there's a rock. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. No more. Are you kidding? Oh. My, there's a way you can go to other islands. I don't have AC, but I entered a giveaway for a Nintendo Switch. Oh, is it like you just enter in dodo codes for other people's islands? I'm trying to go to one of the islands that I can shape, though, into a tarantula island. Or is it like getting Nook, Nook Miles tickets? Time travel is pretty cool. Yes, it is. Time travel is really cool. Play the game how you want to play the game. Don't let anybody, anybody tell you. How to play a game. Period. Okay. Let's go over here. Chop wood. Why? Why? Um, DIY project? Let's just make a ton of saw of wood block toys. Okay, let's just do that. We need to make three of them. Mm. Oh! It resets the durability if you customize? Y'all really did something with that. <laughs> Is everything a JoJo reference? Da, 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 da. Let's see. We're gonna get some crafting supplies so we can make uh, all the things that we need to make because I broke all the tools. And oh wait, we need our customization kits. That way, it'll reset the durability of the ones that I do have already. Uh, sorry. Oof. What's okay? What is gonna happen whenever I burp on stream? What is the thing that you guys are gonna do in the chat? I should make a burp emote, and I will do that at some point. But for now, what is the goal? What is the what is what are we gonna do? Yes, we're making ourselves very emo. MXM burp. MXM burp. I feel like you should. Oh, man. Can we just lads, lads, lads? Pinkies up, laddies. 
All the way at the end. Yes. Laddies. Lads. 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 I don't know why the word lad is so funny to me. It's like... It just is. I feel like you understand exactly what kind of person that is. And it's like cross-cultural too. Every country has a lad. And they're all the same. Watering can. Wow, I am never making new tools again. Lads is British slang, I think, right? Oh, it's Jack Septicai's thing. Why did I forget that? Oh, I forgot that. Thank you for liking unspoken words and checking out the stream. Let's continue customizing. I'm scared to play Smash on stream because I know that I'm not good. Will you all judge me? And also, I only play Kirby. Lad is British. British. Lad is British, though. Lad is British. Um, I'm done for now. Let's do it. We got it. Okay. Kirby. Kirby is superior. Kirby. Kirby, Kirby, ye, Kirby. Your English accent is really interesting. So, I don't- I think I've told this story multiple times, but I played Hermione in my third grade play, and I was one of two kids in my class that chose to spoke, speak in a British accent the whole time. So, I was literally, like, eight years old on stage playing Hermione Granger, being like, Harry! We could die or worse get expelled it was like eight literally eight years old and then also i played the magic mirror in snow white in a kindergarten play and i also spoke in a british accent at the age of five years old but i didn't know what it was i just thought it was a dramatic accent and so when the queen came up to me and i was like this little tiny five-year-old i was just like you, my queen, or the fairest of them all. And I was tiny. And I don't know where I learned that accent from. I think I was just from audiobooks and listening to, like, Harry Potter. It was it was ridiculous. And all, <laughs> all the teachers that were involved in this, like, little tiny kindergarten production were, like, asking my parents, where did she learn that? <laughs> it was so bad. Oh, my God. Okay, which, which tools do we not have? Let's check it out. Um, ew. Whoa, wait. Vibes. Let's see. Which tools do I not have? Right now, I have a watering can, a slingshot. We broke our axe. We reset our net. I have everything except for an axe. Ooh. When I meet you, eventually you're going to be very confused at my accent because it's it's a British accent properly. Can you give me an example of what an, a proper British accent would be? Let's craft. You can't customize axes. What? Say less. Dang it. That sucks. Oh, man. Boom, ba boom, boom, ba boom, ba boom, ba boom. Can you speak in an Irish accent? I can say Dublin. That's how everyone sounded. Dublin. Da, 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 dun, da, dun, da. My listen to a Yorkshire accent. That's proper British. Okay. I need to... Uh, I'm one of those people that does walk around her house like a crazy person talking in accents. Usually don't Robbie and Taha have British accents. Yes, they do. I don't really notice their accent. It's like obviously there, but it is funny. <laughs> Wait. I... This is... Okay. So this is, a, this is a story you guys will probably enjoy. When I was working on... Um, the Masquerade, which is my first album, if you don't listen to my music at all, uh, I make music. And when I was working on my first album, I worked with Robbie, who was a producer for the whole thing. I had spoken to Robbie twice before we started living together for two weeks of our lives. Which, like, looking back on it, it's just, like, wildly funny that you can, like, move in with a stranger for half a month and then have never spoken to them before except for two FaceTime calls. And I was legitimately nervous 
about living with this British dude and having to consciously remind myself not to speak in a British accent. I was so worried that I would start slipping into the, one of the monologues I start having when I'm like by myself in my house, like full on just going off on some tangent that means nothing is like absolutely so not relevant in front of Robbie. And like also being really afraid to respond to him after he said things and then like <laughs> not copy his accent. <laughs> I was really worried about it. <laughs> Robbie kind of knows a little bit, but like it was really funny because he would do an American accent and I would be like, wow, you're really good at that. <laughs> and I wouldn't think twice about the fact that he would go into it, but like I was really worried about me doing it as an American person. I was like, I, I can't do it. I can't allow myself to go to that place. So I was really worried, but <laughs> eventually I started going, um, I went on tours Robbie in December with his crew and like was around British people all the time. And so I would speak in like my version of it because I just got really comfortable with these people and I, my ego was just through the roof because all these people would be like, wow, you're actually really good at that. And I was just like, all right, cool. This is amazing. I have like legitimate reason to believe that I'm okay at this. Huh. <sighs> If Maya ever hosts SNL, her monologue must be completely be in British. Yeah. Hello, Robbie. Can you get me a glass of water? <laughs> oh my god. Of water. Oh my god. Yeah, I was really worried. Anyways, that was my two weeks of trauma. Just kidding. But Robbie and I are now good friends. Of water. Could I get a glass of water, please? Let's see, what was I doing? Oh, I keep getting distracted. Let's go to Blathers. There's so many freaking birds on this island. Thanks, love. <laughs> Do you guys know that girl on TikTok who, I think her name is just like Rita Grace or something like that. She does the Harry Styles Wattpad POVs. <laughs> Britain is not England. Please understand. I do know this. Yes. Oh my gosh. They, but she has these Wattpad POVs with Harry Styles of like One Direction. And it's, they're so funny. Drink your fluffing water. Stay hydrated, kings, queens, and everybody's in betweens. Ugh, I needed a burp, but it wasn't gonna happen. Assess my fossils. Water. You're literally Harry Styles, love. Sorry, I'm gonna get way too comfortable on the stream. I talk in like a French accent with my best friend Anna very often, too. We were walking around New York for like two hours talking in horrible French accents. Just because we were like, maybe if we talk like this, people will believe that we are not from here. Like, could you believe we are legitimately tourists? That's really, really bad. We were talking for two hours. This is how you know when you have a best friend is if you can, if you can like just talk with your friend in two hours about nonsense and an accent. You know. Da, da, da. Tom Holland about to be jealous when he see this. Okay. Wait, no, no, no. I messed up. Blathers, please talk to me. Blathers, please talk to me. Blathers, Blathers. So one of the things that I did when I was obsessed with Tom Holland is I entered a giveaway to be flown out to meet him. I'm going to let that marinate for a second. Your French accent is like super good. No, no, no. Don't tell me that. Don't tell me that. You're going to make my ego too big. I, yes, I entered a giveaway to, <laughs> oh my god, oh, what is wrong with me? I entered, I, Maya, MXM2, entered a giveaway to be flown out to meet Tom Holland. <laughs> if anyone ever asks me if I'm a simp, I'm just gonna be honest and say yes. I'm just gonna say yes. And at the time, 
<laughs> bro. I spent twenty dollars to get one raffle ticket, and obviously I didn't get it. There was a part of me that was like, "Wow, what if I did get flown out to meet Tom Holland, be put up in this really nice hotel, and then I could go in the behind the scenes of Spider-Man: Far From Home?" Can you believe that? That would have been legendary. I, and it would cost me 20 bucks. A whole ass meal. I could have bought a whole ass meal, but instead I spent it on a raffle ticket to go and meet Tom Holland. I have shared too much information on this live stream. <laughs> oh my god. I'm not completely sure what a simp is, but can someone explain it to me? Okay, Cameron, let me explain to you what a simp is and what it has been turned into from... Um the internet it, the 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 more raunchy meaning of a simp is a person who will do anything to uh let's see let's how can i graphically not explain this i don't know someone in the in the chat do it <laughs> Scrolls in my pants. <laughs> they do <laughs> They do anything to clap cheeks. Ah! This is why I don't do the explaining. I think I, it's best I leave these things to you. You all. How have I been streaming for an hour already? Let's order food. I'm gonna order some food. <laughs> my best friend's watching. <laughs> I talked about us. Were you here for that? My best friend, you guys want to say hi to Anna? Say hi to Anna in the chat. Ma'am, I have been typing in the chat, you ding dong. <laughs> she went. Ma'am, I. Wait, no, play it. I have been typing in the chat, you ding dong. She called me a ding dong. Anna, where's your username? I can't see you. Anna, do you want to send anything else to the stream to say hi? Can you call them all ding dongs? She's, okay, follow Anna on TikTok if you guys want to. Her, her username is stupid freaking idiot. Oh, okay, now I can see it. I can see it. Ding dong. Anna is a ding dong. Anna's definitely a ding dong. But you're not allowed to call her that. I'll, I am the only one that's allowed to call her a ding dong. And that's on ding dong. Oh my god. Anna's been here the whole time. Wow. Look at these cuties with their rain hats. Wait, I was gonna order food. My, uh, I called her a ding dong. Mwahahaha. <laughs> okay, so funny of you. <laughs> I'm gonna order foods. Let's see. Food time, food time, food time. Yum, 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 yummy food time. That's on ding dong. Oh, we have another audio message. Pain. Guys, did you hear that? She said bread in French. Pain. Multilingual queen. <laughs> yes, exactly. She said, ah. oh, I miss her. I'm so sad. I'm going crazy in quarantine. I'm going crazy. Okay. No, I'm not going to order. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh, I miss her. Uh, this is turned into a stream where I sit for my best friend. I'm looking respectfully. This is the live feed of the memes that I'm getting. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's order food now. Let's order food. Uh, okay. Do I want Chinese food? Do I want tacos? Do I want... Sorry. <laughs> She's shit posting in our iMessage chat now. Okay. Okay, let's see. Let's go to um I had five guys the other day on stream. That was pretty good. Oh, I really want sushi, but 
I don't know. Do I want... I might get Hawaiian food. Ooh. Hawaiian food, bro. This is not an ad. This is definitely not an ad. I'm not even telling you which food delivery service I'm using because I want to be sponsored by all of them. You want me to get Chipotle? Nah. 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 What'd it do? I think I'm gonna get Hawaiian food. I don't have Shake Shack. Lucas, I don't have Shake Shack. I'm on the West Coast. Actually, we do have Shake Shack, but it's far away. It's not gonna take orders from me. I'm gonna get Hawaiian food, and I'm gonna get um, Spam Musubi and Macaroni Salad. Yay! Spam Musubi! Macaroni Salad and Spam Musubi, and then I'm gonna drink... Should I get a coconut? Get a whole ass coconut? Coconut. What a vulgar word. Yes. Which side of the bay, Maya? The east side. <coughs> the east side. A whole coconut. I could get a whole co a whole co coconut, a coconut. How long has she been streaming? You can do exclamation point uptime. Uptime. You had five guys on your stream. What kind of? <laughs> <laughs> okay, everyone. Anna is the, one of the funniest people I have met. She texted me. You had five guys on your stream? What kind of stream are you doing? I just want to say this is a family-friendly stream. This is a totally family-friendly stream. Um, okay? That's it. That's all it is. That's the truest thing you could say. <laughs> Let me text my family and see if they want anything. Do you want Hawaiian food? Because I'm a considerate daughter. I am very considerate. The most considerate, in fact. Oof. Let's see here. I was going to, um, let me put myself on a full cam for a second. There we go. Now I can see your faces. You can see my face while I do this. I need to wait for my family to respond. How the fuck you do uptime? Exclamation point, uptime. Uptime. Coconuts scare me. Coconuts are really good. Consider, coconuts have hair. They, oh. Coconut, live birth? Coconuts don't have live birth? What? Oh, I need to burp again. You know what to do, everyone. Oh, man. Family respond. Boop, 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 boop. You could be cooking stream and make fried rice and spam. I don't know how to necessarily do that to move my whole setup somewhere else. But I think I'll figure it out at some point. Because I'll probably be in quarantine for another month and a half at the, the very least. Should I just yell up to my family? Lads, 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 lads. Fried rice and spam, and yeah, who said that? Ooh, no, 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 no. Can we all agree that potatoes are the most versatile vegetable, though? I think that goes without saying that potatoes definitely are the most versatile vegetable. They can um, be batteries. They can um, also be eaten, I guess. Oh, oh. Okay. My mom is the only one that is home right now. Do you want spam musubi? Ah, okay. She wants macaroni salad. Oof. <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's add some macaroni salad for my mother. DoorDash froze. Oh, I accidentally mentioned the name of the of the thing. Sorry, everybody. This is going to take a second. I'm just ordering the food. Not sponsored. Most definitely not sponsored. DoorDash, please sponsor me. Um, <laughs> please. I'm selling out now. What else am I supposed to do? Let's do... Um, here we go. There we are. Macaroni salad. Spam with Oh. It's taking so long to load. There are probably so many people that are trying to freaking order food. And I'm gonna check out 40 minutes. I'm so hungry. Oh, oh, 
crap. I hit order. There's a lot of mac salad. And he can have a musubi if... Sorry, I'm literally just reading out the text that I am sending to my family. Okay. Let's, um, 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 Okay. Uh... Switching over to switch. A key. Let's do. We have a new sub. Thank you, Scrimshaw. Thank you for the sub. In weird opinion, but cauliflower should only be cauliflower. Def not mash cauliflower. Cauliflower rice, just saying. Fun fact, cauliflower is my favorite vegetable besides zucchini. Zucchini. Okay, what else do we need to do here? We, oh, we were crafting. We have to complete a DIY project. I think that we could make, um, hi, Marie. Look at this queen in her all pink outfit. Oh my goodness. She says blurp. Oh, she's so cute. All of our laundry is getting drenched out here. Say lucky. In the past month, my vocabulary has really transitioned over to say lucky. Zucchini's not trash. Zucchini's so good. Everyone says zucchini. How do you say it? Zucchini. <laughs> say lovey. That's been my whole entire vocabulary. Zucchini. Oh, have you seen the movie on Netflix that is called... Z it's like something about a boy named Zucchini, and it's really cute. Zucchini bread is also really good. I know that sounds weird, but zucchini bread is, you have to trust me, it's very delicious. Very yummy. Oh, we can make a rocking chair? That's kind of cute. Let's make a rocking chair. Courgette. I think I'm gonna learn Duolingo. Does Duolingo still have clubs? Could I be held accountable if I started a Duolingo club and then with you all, we could all learn French together? That would be fun, right? Courgette. Oh my god. Ooh. Ooh. Dark wood. Customize. Yeah! Rocking chair. I'm fluent in French. <gasps> Can you teach me? Wee oui, wee. Oui. Le Pen. My mom did a, an exchange program in France and knows some French. And I wanted her to teach me, but we don't remember how to speak it. Put in storage. Put in storage. My social battery is draining so fast and I don't know what to do. I need to eat some food. I'm so hungry. Mm. Do you ever... Is everyone in here an introvert? And do they know what I mean when you feel like your social battery is about to die? Oh my god. It's so hard, everybody. I used to think that Twitch streaming didn't do it for me. Oh boy, does it do it. Uh... It's dying so fast. I need to take a second. This is what it looks like for introverts when they're like hanging out with their friends and then all of a sudden it just they go like this and they look at a wall and then they just That's what happens. Oh, wow, wow, wow. The amazing. Have I been saying your username right? I adore your animations. How are you? How are you, good sir? So to the tiny tanuki. Mm -hmm. I'm literally my whole brain just fucking died. Give me the things. Here we go. Oh my god, everybody! Oh, we're freaking 50 miles away. 
I don't do the stock market. The turnips stress me out too much. Yeah, too much. Okay, this is easy. We're gonna change our look from this to something else. Oh, oh, yeah. It is most definitely... <laughs> I'm sorry. I feel like, okay, I'm gonna go real serious for a second. Quarantine's been really exhausting and I have a lot of family stuff that's happening behind the scenes and also a lot of work things. And like, Twitch streaming has been fun for me, but it is like, it is like a different form of socialization in the same way where I'm using a lot of my own personal battery. And I think everything is starting to catch up. Like, the state of the world is really hard and like, I don't wanna keep saying it, like, I feel very thankful to be able to do a lot of what I'm able to do right now, where it's playing video games for people, but I'm trying to become more easy on myself when I notice the exhaustion that I feel. And I'm not, I'm definitely a workaholic. I really like working constantly. And so it's, it's, it's strange. I mean, we're all just acclimating to the way that the world is right now. And so be easy on yourself when you need to take a moment, the same way that I will continue to try and do that for myself. Mm hmm. I am okay. My me mental health is, you know, it was at an all-time low a couple weeks ago, and I recently I stopped going to therapy, if you want to know, late last year, and that was really bad for me. So I've gotten back into that, and that's been helpful, but, um, you know, I'm taking the steps that I can. That's all you can do is just take it a day at a time, so I'm okay. I'm okay right now on the stream, don't worry. I think that I just think that I have to live up to this, like, ultra extroverted personality that everybody wants to see but that's not really true i can just chill and play animal crossings i just have to be easy on myself and not so hard on my personality so don't worry about it i'm okay i'm don't don't stress out i'm fine i think that i just think that i have to be very high energy all the time and act like an extrovert when in reality i don't need to be anything more than i am who i am is perfectly fine i don't know and remember that for yourself too remember that for yourself too it's okay. It's okay not to be 100%, and that's fine. Da -da -da -da. I think that we all hold ourselves to higher standards than everybody else holds us to, and so we have to remember that. Be kind to others and to yourself. Let's see. I want to make a cute outfit. Life advice is done. It's over. I'm just kidding. It'll probably happen a couple more times. <laughs> it's okay. We're just, we're just vibing. Let's see. The straw hat's really cute, but I think that I, these hats are... Where... Did I? I thought we got this one in a different color too. Please take time for yourself. We love you and care about you. And we don't, you don't overwork yourself. Do what you love and take time for yourself. Thank you. That's really sweet. I will. And I do. I mean, like reality is I think I have it a lot easier than a lot of people right now. And so I just do what I can when I can for others. But yeah, I will. Don't worry. <laughs> Let's see. I'm going to put, this is a nightgown. It's so cute though. What? What? Okay, this is still one of my favorite outfits. I love these pants. These embellished denim pants are so cute. Mama, mama, mama. Are those things your therapist told you to tell you yourself because it sounds something like a therapist would tell you? My therapist mostly just tells me to be easy on myself and I think that's it. But I come to a lot of my own conclusions about what's good for my brain on my own. As I think, you know, some people work better working things out on their own time and with their own self. And I am not one of those people. I think I do require processing information with other people. But, um, yeah. <laughs> you opening up about your mental health is really, really comforting to me because sometimes I feel very alone in my struggle and seeing someone like you who has done amazing things talk openly about their struggles helps so much. Oh, I'm really glad. That makes me really happy. I think oftentimes I'm actually asked a lot about mental health being something that I talk about so openly on my platform. And like, you know, people being surprised by my choice to do that. But I mean, I don't know. I just think I struggled for so long in the dark about my own relationship to anxiety and depression and not feeling like what I was feeling was right or, or normal. And um, I don't know. I think if I can be one person that people can look to on social media or in the general space of the internet and, and pop culture and just like make my struggles known to a larger audience i think sometimes it feels for other people they can see that as like an attention tactic but i don't know i mean sure people can see it that way but 
I just think that representation of any kind is really important, especially mental health. And if I can be an advocate for representation for people of color, for people of the LGBTQ community, for mental health and everything, that's what I can do. And I can't speak on anybody else's experience but my own, so I'll do what I can with sharing my own story to hopefully help people feel like they see themselves reflected. Yeah. Hmm. Ah. Renny knows. Not because I'm emotional. Not this time. <laughs> just because. I don't know why. My nose is just runny. I think I might be getting a tiny bit of a cold. <laughs> Mental health issues are very prevalent in today's society, and a lot of people are afraid of being open for the sake of their reputations or image. It helps give people with no voice in the world feel more comfortable with themselves and others and makes the world a little bit brighter. That's definitely very true. I think even now, like, I, I mean, so much of where my focus has been shifted has been to the fact that a lot of the world is now sitting in these solitary and really lonely places where we all have to stay home and that can be really hard and it's not easy for everyone to be left in a room by themselves not everybody is comfortable with that reality and so i mean if i can do something like a twitch stream which helps people feel like their brain can just be distracted for three hours or however long i'm on online that's important for me it feels like a small step for what i can do yeah blow your nose no never never okay let's go to a tarantula island everybody it's happening we're gonna get this faint counter going thank lucas everybody Nicole 415 let's fly Let's fly. No, no, no. Let's see. Right. Tools are all ready. I love you, Orville. Yeah, quarantine is really isolating. It's like, I mean, I am with my whole family, and I feel very lucky because I'm really close with all of them. But I know that it's not easy for everyone. Like, there's a lot of people that are going back to their living situations with families that they don't feel safe in. Wait, why are people saying Maya no? Ah. Anyways, it's fine. But yeah, I mean, like, quarantine is not going to be an easy situation for people, so... I don't know. I know some, like, my personal beliefs, I always want to try and do as much as I can for other people. And so, I am just gonna do what I feel like is in my power while I'm in this situation. Okay, let's look at the situation. Let's assess the situation. I've actually made this exact island into a tarantula island before. Not on the last stream. Wait, was this the last stream? I think it was just flopped to the other side. Hey, this is my first stream of yours and it was super fun. Sorry I have to leave early. Well, thank you for joining in. I really appreciate it. Oh my goodness. I'm glad that you could make it. Let's clean up these flowers here. Wait. I'm so stupid. If I change the time now, will it... I just realized, I just hit me. I didn't make the connection. I need to change the time. I wasted 2,000 bells. If I change, oh my God. I have to wait three hours, three hours. What do I do? Cause I can't change the time now. I'm such a ding dong. Anna was right, damn. Um. Okay. I don't think this is gonna work. <laughs> oh, this lady in gems is why you don't time skip. I think I would have still done this even if I wasn't time skipping. Oh, 
everybody could say goodbye to Anna. Damn it. I was so into my talk about mental health that I didn't think about it. Uh, I have to get to 2,000 miles again. Or I could not play Animal Crossing until Friday. Stay on this island. And no, that, that wouldn't work either. God damn it. This is such an L. This is such an L. Uh, no. Close the game without saving? But I didn't have... Let's see what happens, I guess. Should I try it? I'm nervous. I don't think it's gonna work. That's why everyone was yelling. It's a chat, no one can yell. <laughs> I think it auto-saved at some point. It won't work. Bro! <laughs> breaking, breaking, breaking. Please, at least have my Nook Miles. That is all I ask of you. Spare the Nook Miles. This is so stressful. Doesn't it auto-save when you travel? It doesn't work, trying to yell. <laughs> Can I just take the L? Ah! Mm, don't talk to me, me Angie. I cannot believe that. I cannot. <sighs> cannot believe it. Cannot believe it. I don't have the energy in me. I have a very long headphone cord. Should I play a, a game of sitting just dance? Let's see. MXM dance. We're changing the game title. Yikes. Let's see. Oh, it changes it automatically? Wow. I'm not gonna actually. Let's do this, everybody. I can't believe it. I just. I could not. Oh, thank you, Eric. I, you're so fast at changing. Oh my god. I love my mods. I feel very thankful. Holding on and warm up. I know that they have did it, did it on here. I can't believe this. <sighs> How do I go later? Oh. <laughs> the validity period for your Just Dance Unlimited has ended. You must purchase a new pass to use Just Dance Unlimited. Can I do it later? No, stop. I don't want to. Just let me go here. I don't want to pay for this. Yes, close it. I was really nervous my card information would show up. Look at, okay, yes. Look at my, my profile, I'm level 12. I am a nomad. Let's see, I think they have did it to this. <laughs> what? Wait, 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 wait. Got five stars on this. Oh, yes! I haven't done this one in a very long time. Do, 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 do. 
Okay, I'm totally gonna fail at this very miserably. This is another one for the K-pop stands. I have to back it up. I moved my heater. I wasn't prepared to do this today. Okay, I have to turn my camera. Can you see? I can't see, I don't have my glasses on. I'm gonna get copyrighted.
Dua Lipa, Duolingo Queen. Alright. Which song do you guys want? Dula Peep. <laughs> Honestly, Blackpink's the only valid choice that's in here. Dula Pete, you want new rules? I think I got five stars last time I did this. Not to brag, though. Not to brag. I changed the title of this stream. This is no longer me time skipping. This is me paying my dues for time skipping, though. What is she doing with her arm? Talking in my sleep at night, making, making myself, myself crazy. crazy. Out of my mind, out of my mind. Wrote it down and read it out, hoping it would save me. Too many times, too many times. Too many times. My love, it makes it feel like nobody else. <laughs> nobody else. But my love, this is really slow. Can we pick it up? Don't pick up the phone, you know he's only calling cause he's alone Two, Two. don't let him in, you have to kick him out again Three. Three, don't be his friend, you know you're gonna wake up in his bed in the morning You ain't getting over him I, I got, got no side gun What? This is very confusing I think I'm getting the hang of this. <laughs> My arms are really tired. Is this what happens when you don't exercise in like five years? I didn't get it. Look how awkwardly I am posed. Damn. Exercise is hard. Uh -huh. Thank you for the subcast. Oh my god. I think I should be on Just Dance. We're losing so many viewers. Is it worth it? Yes. I don't think they have One Direction. I would be really good friends with Joanna Sedia. In fact, I do watch her. Hero. My dog's outside barking. <sighs> so tired. So tired. 
So much has happened on this stream. I gave life advice. I played, um... <laughs> Thank you, Eric. <laughs> Turned the dance workout during quarantine. <laughs> Thank you, Eric. I'm drinking water. Wow. Have I burned like two calories? Let's do bang, 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 because someone asked for more K-pop. I don't think I've done this one either. I love the music video for this. We don't stand. Um... <laughs> this one is the easiest to spot without my glasses on. Why did my manager just text me? You've doubled your Twitch followers in the last 25 days. Hey, wait! Thank you to everyone that's followed the Twitch stream! <laughs> oh my god, I'm killing this! I think headphone quarters is really making this difficult. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is what exercise feels like. Bro, do not sign me up for this. Do not sign me up. I'm in my pajama pants. I 
I can't believe this. Okay, what's up next? Last one. Last one. I killed that shit. I don't know what they- I don't care what they say. I killed it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's go. Oh my god. This is so I can eat Hawaiian food later. This is so I can eat it. Okay. Never killed nobody. Do they have other K-pop songs on here? Uh, no. Ah, oh, you know what to do. Play Overwatch with somebody? No. <laughs> Not today. Oh my god. Oh, they have a Poco Loco? Yes. Oh my god, Britney Spears? Yes, we're doing it. Sorry, no Pixar rights today, no Disney rights. You better work, bitch! My, I am so tired. Have I done this before? Yes. Oh crap, I maybe haven't. You better work, bitch.
Brittany. That was just, that was so much for me to take in. Oh my God. All right, let's change the category. I got this. Don't worry, everybody. I am bad at Smash. Kirby main. Smash. Brothers. Wait. On that day when the sky fell away, our world came to an end. In our eyes, did a fading sunrise in the dark, glimmering shadows. We're good now. I don't want to watch this whole intro. Anyone who does that for two hours is that bitch. I don't think that I could do dance working out for dance working out dance workouts for two whole hours. That'd be so much. Also, I'm not gonna play against other people because I'm actually so trash at this game. It is insane. Thank you for the sub, boiled egg. Welcome to you are now officially an egg under the MXM Tune subs. It's very exciting. I am that bitch. I'm not gonna apologize. I do be that bitch. Let me get my phone really fast that I threw onto the couch. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay let's see let's see i let's see what was i doing i'm doing it on easy don't judge me i'm a smash noob i have never actually played smash until this game that's a lie i did play it on the wii a little bit but oh yes i forgot i'm akira i did buy money so that way i, I did buy money i did buy um the smash persona 5 add-on Let's fucking fight this Jigglypuff. Um, we're gonna use because I don't understand Joker's Joker's vibe yet. We're gonna go with Kirby. I haven't played this game in a very long time either. Um, back. Wait, no, no, no. Well, yes, I want Kirby, but but back. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I think we're gonna lose. Oh no, just kidding. We need to change our spirits. We're gonna, um. Jupiter! No, no, no. Maybe? No, that's wrong. We have a better one. Ah, yes. Wait, no! I'm so bad at this game. I can't even choose the character selection. Sh I love your Smash streams, even if you're bad at Smash. I've, I've successfully, um. Okay, we've we've dealt with the sticky floor. Let's fight. I've been streaming Smash for two whole minutes now. This is. Bro, Joker does look like Harry Potter. Jigglypuff's so fucking annoying. We're gonna we're gonna beat her up. Is Jigglypuff a dude or? A... Ah! What the hell? I just let me bonk you. This is the only reason I like Kirby. Cause he can bonk people. I'm gonna swallow you. Absolute degenerate. No, 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 no. <laughs> no. No. See, I told you I'm like very bad at this. This is why I don't play. No. No. <laughs> Let me fuck you! Yes! Okay. Choo choo. Battle of the Bonk. I challenge you all whenever I bonk with Kirby to send a. Uh, is that actually what that em emote's called? Is it a bonk? Oh, it's Bop emote. I've never actually. Let me fuck you up! Pog. Raymond? Oh my god, that is a throwback to my childhood. I don't think that I can actually beat him yet, so I'm gonna go over here. My brother always says that I could, but I'm just too afraid. I'm too scared. What is wrong with that man's sneakers? 
That's horrifying. Thank you for the sub, Cammy. Okay. Diddy Kong. Diddy Kong. Ready? That spider's freaky. Go! Oh, I hate this map. Come up here. <laughs> oh my god. Come up here. Come up here. Come up here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Come up here. Come up here. <laughs> ah! Yes. <laughs> I'm really bad at Smash, but I still get really excited <laughs> if I win. <laughs> I'm on easy. We should all remember that I'm on easy and I can't feed my ego like this. Oh my god. Hero, don't bark! Uh, what's over here? Let's kick Daisy's ass, everybody. I'm gonna die fighting Pauline for sure. Timed battle, hostile assist trophies will appear when the enemies at high damage. Ready, no ho, I don't like when there's two of them. Why are they running? Why are you running? Come here. Come here. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Don't be shy. Oh. This is so slow. No. Oh! Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I don't understand. Let me... I'm so slow. Please come here. Please come here. That's all I ask of you is just to come here. Boy. <laughs> My, it's time. What do you want from me? What do you want? I'm trying. You know, not to flex. What is going on? What does this mean? No! What? I want to swallow him. What is this? I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Guys, Daisy, let me bonk you. Oh my gosh. Literally, I love being the worst Smash player known to mankind. I got 50 seconds. I just need to bonk her once. That's all. Oh my god. She's so annoying. This bitch. Oh my god. Can I? <laughs> that was just embarrassing. That was just embarrassing. <laughs> Good lord. <laughs> Okay, next thing. Wow, secondhand stress. <laughs> if that's only entertainment I'm providing is secondhand stress, that's at least some form of entertainment. Let's check on my food. Ah, my food is on its way. Ooh. Ah, wait. Is it here? Ah! My food is delivered! Maya, do you not know that everything you say is basically an innuendo? Oh, no. I didn't really quite think about that. I did not think about it. Oopsie. <laughs> okay, wait, hold on. We're going over to full cam. I'm gonna go grab my food. I will be right back. Right back. I'll be right back.
I'm here. It's mukbang time. All right. Why is everyone saying bonk? What's going on? Bonk, 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 bonk. Wait, are we gonna reach 11,000 today? I know I was setting up a follower goal to see if we could reach 11,000. Bonk, bonk, MXM bonk. Should I make the stupidest idea ever? Should I sell inflatable hammers and call it MXM bonk? Excellent genius of marketing. I should get a degree. Okay, so we have MXM tool, MXM bonk, and that is all of our uh, marketing ideas so far. Let's see. I think that <laughs> I'm really onto something here. 10 out of 10 marketing genius. Marketing pog. <laughs> wow. Okay, I'm eating. We got macaroni salad. It's very yummy. Oh. I'll drop more. Mmm. I like some stocks. <laughs> Watch your manager text you right now and be like, uh. Honestly, I'm very lucky. My managers are very supportive of my business ideas. Hmm. Would someone like to explain what a pog is? Do you guys know what these are? They're sound panels. Someone very, very commented that up so far in the actual comment chat. I searched it up and it said pee on God. Oh my God. It does not mean that. It could technically, but it doesn't. Pog champ. Someone do explain in Pog. Mm -hmm. You don't want the Mac salad close to the mic. Someone told me that everything I say is an innuendo right before I went and got my food. And eating Mac salad close to a mic is definitely dangerous territory. I have limits. I have standards I set for myself. I just got here. The stream about to end. Nah. The mukbang just started. Okay. Back to smash. Richter. We have to change our party. We're gonna go back to Kyle when we don't have anything to adjust do da do ba bru ba ba MXM poggers where MXM tune is making the poggers face oh I can do that so easily you'll have that next stream I did the wrong thing no yes no no Hey, what? What? How did that? We ate him. What? I don't like this guy. <laughs> Ew, let me in. What? <laughs> Bro. Thank you. We bopped him. No. No. Donut. No! No. Oh no, oh no, oh no! We do be bloop 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 bing, bloop bloop bing. This guy! <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> oh my god. 
Oh my god. Oof, that mac salad. Yeah, 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 yeah. I have a spam musubi here. Hmm. Good stuff. Hmm. Hmm. Lads, lads, lads. I feel like we've we've made a lot of um stream traditions in this stream. A lot has happened. It's been only two and hours and fifteen minutes. This music slaps. <laughs> yes. Look at the way that Necro dresses up as him. Uh huh. Uh huh. -huh. Not to flex, but oh my god, that was so good. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what do you have for sale, sir? Oh. Because he doesn't have anything for sale. I don't know what this means, but I'm gonna check that out later, I guess. What's over here? Yoshi! Or it's more like... Yoshi! Ready? Go! Yeah. away from 11,000. We're so close. We're so close. Mm -hmm. We celebrated 10,000 two days ago, so this is pretty cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Come on, lads. That's actually... You guys don't have an official fan base name. I mean, there's like some, you know, crowdsourced ones. We have the Toonies, um, Eggs, which is also one that I made up. I vote that we all go by lads. We're just, that's the fan base. We're just known as lads. Cyrus and Reese. Oh, they're too powerful though. The lads. That's all that you guys are gonna be known as now. I would say lads is gender neutral even though it is associated with men i think that anybody can be a lad a lad is not a gender it's a mindset you know hell yeah thank you lad it's like bro it's gender neutral yeah i think bro it definitely i think lads is a little more inclusive I'm non-binary and lad is pretty chill with me. Okay, good to know. I can't speak for people, but it's just my personal feelings about it. Ready? MXM lads. Go! Let's me bop you. It eat him. Ooh. Blah. Hey, 
Mario. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> yes. Maya discovered the A button. Lad tunes. What? That's so good. Oh my god, I love that. Lads. A lad is not a gender, it's a mindset. Yes. I want to say that's um, it's 100% true. Whew. I don't know if I want to play Smash. Wait! 11,000? Hey! Well done, everybody! Oh my god, we did it. 11,000. So proud of us. Look at us go. Two weeks ago, we were at... I want to say like 6,500 followers. That was two weeks ago. So, um, props to everyone who has become a part of this family in the last two weeks and hanging out and watching me play things and get mad and also try out to being the K-pop star with my dance skills. So thank you. Um, yeah, this is really cool. This is so exciting. I really didn't think that like Twitch streaming was going to be able to be this much of a focus for me. And so this is very, very cool. Um, and I appreciate like, it feels definitely like more like a community than anything that, um, I guess other communities that I have online, I think Twitter and Twitch are probably the two places where it's, there's a lot of overlap with those people too, but it's really sweet because it's like, I can start a stream and I know who's going to be there and I can say hi to people and it feels like you're, I don't know, you're just hanging out with some, some friends. So thank you. Thank you guys very much. Should I sing a song to celebrate? I can sing some songs to celebrate. We can switch over to a just chatty kind of stream and we can all just hang out if that's if that's fine with you ba -ba 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 -ba. yeah no, 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 no. i can probably go for a little bit longer i'm getting a little tired so i'm probably gonna have to hop off in a little bit <laughs> lucas exclamation point discord okay we're gonna set it up then because people there's a high demand for it um sing a song in a british accent i don't think i could do that i don't know if that works that way oh my gosh Na 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 da 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 Old bamboo for well eleven K celebration. Isaiah, we did that for a ten K celebration, so you have to swap it up a little bit. Oh my gosh. Da 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 Also we must say hello at the beginning of every stream. Okay, that's that's a that's um a fair request, I think. If you come to a stream in the future, you have to say hello. That is required now. Maya, I made the full Dying on an Island song. Check it out and sing it, please. I don't know if I could sing it because, let's see. Dying on an Island. I can't find it. It's just a bunch of Dead Island 2 things. I'll search for it after the stream. Don't worry, I'll search for it. I, it's just a bunch of... <laughs> Dead Island. Do you guys have other games that you want me to play, by the way? Let me see. I'm trying to think of what other songs could I play. I've been enjoying playing Quiet Motions on my own. I know that that's a newer one. Play Fire Emblem? Do they have Fire Emblem for Switch? Because I've actually, I've heard about it, but I haven't actually played it. Ba -ba -bow. I really am looking forward to playing Persona 5 Royale. I think I'm probably going to do that this evening with my brother. A, a door giveaway. What? I think that's a... What does that even mean? Is that a... Is that, are you joking with people in the stream? So confused. or temporary nothing i was just fiddling listen w try to sing bubblegum by kk slider i definitely couldn't do that i couldn't do it at all oh my gosh um one of the other days could you give us a story time about why you wrote horse one it's such a good song and honestly makes me cry and i relate to some of the lines of certain things i've been through but i'm curious as to what it means to you oh my gosh okay i can just do that now 
are you guys okay if I just do like a Q&A format type of thing and I just chat? I'm happy to do that for the remainder of 20 minutes. Is that okay? Is that okay? Okay. I've been singing all weekend because I did all these like various live streamy type things for singing. Um, and so I, uh, what am I saying? Oh, the story behind porcelain. The story behind porcelain is really, it's just a song about body confidence and my own struggles with accepting who I am and all of my flaws and all of my, you know, cracks and, and everything. And like, you know, it's really hard getting to a point where you can look at yourself and feel happy. And I wouldn't say that I'm at that point yet. I still have a long way to go, but porcelain is, is just about accepting your fragility um, and ultimately finding the beauty within it. Da, 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 da. Yeah. Kirby Maine, that's my girl. Kirby Maine. I don't know how to play anybody but Kirby. Kirby's controls are the only character that makes sense to me in my brain. Oh my gosh. Have you ever thought about shaving your head? I have, but I literally have a circle, fit, a circle for a head, so, um, I'm gonna wait to do that until I literally have nothing else to do which is very close, but I'm not going to be shaving my head. I think if I did, I would probably look bomb, but I don't really want to look like an egg more than I already do. Can you give some vocal tips, please? I've been wanting to sing, but I'm super embarrassed because my whole family is home. Um, sing like Billie Eilish. <laughs> she sings really quietly, and honestly, that's one way you can learn. It's not entirely healthy to sing that way. Um, getting over the kind of like roadblock of feeling nervous to sing in front of people that you love is really hard. I am still not completely over it. Uh, but if you want like an actual tip for how to sing better, smile. Smiling actually helps you sing. It opens up your vocal cords more and allows you to reach notes that you might not be able to normally if you're looking, if you're looking sad. So that's a tip. How do you come up with songs? Because I have a hard time and I want to be a songwriter. Oh man, that's a tough one. I think about the things that I've been going through a lot um, when I'm thinking about what I want to write a song. I actually have like a note section in my uh, phone that's called On My Mind and it's just a bullet list of like all of the different things that I've been thinking about um, and I look back on it whenever I'm trying to write a song so that way I can talk with other co-writers that might be in the room about that theme and what they might think about it or if I'm writing by myself. Um, Ah, I'm just running with it, yeah. Oh, man. Um, are there any other artists that you think would be surprise people as something... Oh, are there any artists you enjoy that you think would surprise people as something Sweet Baby you Pop Girl MXM Tune listens to? Uh, I recently started listening to a metal band. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's... Let me, let me look them up again. Oh, my gosh. Let me play it for you, too. Fever 333 is really good. <laughs> it's like, it's like Screamo. It's so good, guys. So I listen to metal now. I used to think that I didn't really listen to like I listen to everything, but I think I truly do listen to everything now. Metal Screamo was not on my radar until probably this year. I didn't really listen to a lot of it. Emo music, I was like friends with people that listened to it, but I wasn't actually. Maya, you should listen to 100 Gex. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. The Fever 333 is actually really cool though. I mean, they. The guy who is the main vocalist is, like, super, it's, I mean, for lack of a better way to put it, they're very woke. It's, like, all of their, The Innocent, the song that I was just listening to, is about police brutality and, like, 
he's a black man and so talking about his relationship to watching what's on the news and how disheartening that is for him and his experience so I was listening to it and I was just like damn bro this this be hitting this do be hitting wasn't a rage against the machine okay yeah so I'm more familiar with those ones yeah oh my god who do you want to collaborate with Ooh. Maggie Rogers is one of my like dream collaborations. Hey Maya, would you be okay if I recorded a GIF and um and gift parts of your stream? I don't want to do it. Oh, absolutely, go for it. That's totally fine. Your music really means a lot to me and makes me so inspired. I struggle a lot with my mental health, but when I listen to you, it makes me feel so um so much better. So thank you, and I love you so much. But thank you so much for listening to my music. You guys all make it this possible for me, so thank you. Oh man. called picture this um that puts out similar music as you you should check them out oh i will i'm always looking for more music suggestions because i literally listened to the same playlist that i made in 2014 over and over and over again and i'm not tired of it yet but wow oh man maya what has your experience with being asian american like i was adopted from china and my experience has likely been different from yours but it's always interesting to hear it from other chinese americans yeah i mean my experience is is very different i grew up in um uh the bay area which is filled with more kids like me i went to school with a bunch of other mixed race asian kids but even still when you're grow up in, growing up in an area where um your like cultural background is is more relevant like being able to go to chinatown and everything and not feel like i was alienated from that side of my identity was really nice but you still experience things that are harder to deal with and I think I face it a lot more now that I'm in a field of work where, I mean, it's dominated by white men. And so as a woman of color, it's like really important that I use my voice and exciting for me to also have this opportunity where I can be another voice in a place where I didn't have someone to look up to. And like, I talk about this a lot, but I didn't have any mixed race Asian American or even really Chinese American representation to look to when I was growing up with the media. And so like, I had Keanu Reeves, but it wasn't like I was going to try and be an actress and then go into the Matrix. I definitely was not going to do that. But, I mean, I really wish that I had people that I could have seen myself and my face in the TV um, when I was getting older. So, I don't know. I just feel like I have this really rare opportunity now as a musician and an artist to be able to have, you know, portions of my story shared so hopefully other people see themselves reflected. But, I don't know. I think I struggle a lot, too, with being only half Chinese and claiming that as a part of my identity and feeling valid in it. So, I don't know. I'll let you know. I mean, we're all trying to figure it out. I'm, I'm 19, and I'm still navigating my identity, and I imagine that I'll be doing that until the very day I die. Yeah. How do white guy tell me, but you have Mulan? Oh, my gosh. The historical inaccuracy of Mulan is very bad. <laughs> I did have Mulan. That was the only Disney movie I was actually able to watch when I was a little kid. But, yeah. I mean, it's crazy now. I think we live in this time where Hapa artists are actually, there are so many of us. There's Conan Gray, Audrey Mika, me, Biba Doobie, uh, Mitski. Like, there's so many different people. There's almost like a surplus of them. And I think part of me feels guilty for the fact that I, I feel like I'm just, you know, in the next wave of, you know, the right type of person, I guess. But I don't know. It's I think what's frustrating to me is is like feeling like everyone in a position where they have a platform should speak on issues that affect people and I don't know. Not to say like I am I am better than other people, but I mean I think it's just an important place to be able to talk about your experiences and hopefully shed light on them and I think like I don't know, I feel like that could be done more in in general sense of how the entertainment industry works out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Maya, your stream right now has 3 a.m. deep talk, deep talk vibes, but it's like middle of the afternoon. It is 5.30 in the afternoon. 5.30 in the afternoon. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if that made any sense. I am... Yeah, I'm not going to say that. <laughs> uh, the white kids at my school call me black. Black people think I'm too white. Oh, man. Welcome to my entire identity crisis. That is why I wrote a song called Birdie. 
It's like, I don't know. I am a spicy white person, but a bland Asian is how I would describe myself and the way that other people see me. Sing gimme gimme, spicy white person. Y'all put me into a writing mood. I was talking with my boyfriend about it last night, but I mean, this whole coronavirus situation has been really hard, too. Like, as an Asian person watching so many discriminatory things be said to other people and any Asians in general, I think it's really hard to be... Asian right now and it's always been difficult to be a person of color generally but I mean I don't know how much you guys know about or I, I did a lot of like work with studying like um doing ethnic studies and stuff and talking about mixed race literature in school and I mean Asian Americans are the model minority which means that they're expected to have the best behavior out of people of color and POC and um and I think like it's really hard as a Chinese American person right now in the world and in the, in the climate of how everything is, I feel really frustrated with my ability to do stuff sometimes and wanting to speak on issues of, of race and ethnicity, but not always feeling as a mixed race person if I have the space to do that or the validity to talk about it, because I can only experience what I've experienced and I can look at what other people are going through, but I don't know. I just get frustrated. I wish I could do more. And I can use my platforms for good as much as I can try, but I don't know. I think I struggle with feeling like, where is my place in this whole dialogue? And how can I effectively be an ally to a community of people that I feel I'm a part of, but also know that I have enormous privilege being half white too? Yeah. Wow. Dang. A lot of people are mixed race here. really do be talking seriously about the state of the world <laughs> i've seen so much bullshit being said on the internet i think a lot of people negate the racism asians experience because they are the model minority and are more likely than other minorities to be financially successful but the shit you all experience is so valid and should be invalidated thank you saw your reply to trump retweet referring to covid19 as the chinese virus just an fyi not all right wingers are that xenophobic i don't believe that i think there are I don't believe that right-wing people are bad by nature. I think that some of the belief systems that some of them have and those who are highlighted as right-wing are a lot more conservative in a way that I don't agree with, oftentimes than people that are more moderate. So I don't think that political beliefs define a person, but um, I just encourage people to have educational dialogue with each other to push back against each other's beliefs. And that goes for people that are left and that goes for people that are right. I think my main issue with the way that the world works right now is everything, not to get too political, but everything is very polarizing. And I think that what I hope for the world is for people to still be willing to have conversations. Because I think with things like cancel culture and with like, obviously, sometimes it's very valid when someone who has done something unspeakably horrible is canceled. But I do think that we as people need to come from a place of, you know, understanding and empathy. And if we can have a dialogue about things, that's a hundred times more productive than immediately trying to shut down something that you could, you don't understand. And I think if you have a belief, you are... 100% valid in that belief as long as you can back it up and you can fight for it because that's what it comes down to at the end of the day I think like you know it's it should be I don't know yeah I don't know I think I said what I wanted to say
Mm-hmm. I'm half white and half Hispanic, but I look like I look half white and half Asian, so I get called racial slurs. I usually am the Asian people. Any tips of dealing with that? Oh my gosh. Being ethnically ambiguous is so frustrating. I'm very lucky that I think I look very much just like what I am, but I can't imagine how frustrating that is for you. I think that one of the best things that you can do as a mixed race person when you are so frustrated by what other people think about you I think oftentimes I know my own frustration with that comes from my own insecurity with my own identity. And so feeling more valid on my own and the way that I view myself has helped me come to terms with the fact that other people are not going to ever understand the way that I feel internally. So the least I can do is be kind to myself because if other people aren't going to do that, that's a luxury I should give to me. Yeah. If that makes sense. Mm. I'm not mixed, but I get called a leprechaun. I'm so sorry. People are really mean. I It makes me so sad. The people are so mean. Ugh. Like, I just... I don't understand why people choose to be hurtful and harmful. Everyone here, be nice. Be a nice individual. Because even if people are cruel to you, if you put positive energy in the world, you are helping everyone ultimately. Being any type of person or any type of person with an identity that other people can't visually see, whether that's your sexuality, your your gender identity, your ethnic background, it's so frustrating when people will constantly tell you who you are and it doesn't agree with what you believe you are and you know you are. Just know that people do be kind of garbage though. They do be kind of garbage and you know your truth and even though other people are not always going to know it and not going to be able to see it, just know that you are completely valid and there are people that are going to believe you and you're going to find those people that are going to support you and want to love you and all that you are and let you decide what you be viewed as. So just know that there are people out there, despite how many hurtful things that can be said to you you will find your people. That's all. I'm still finding mine. We're all in this together. Damn, this stream was all over the place. I danced for like four songs. I played Animal Crossing and then I messed up and then I time skipped and I did a did a oopsie. I talked about mental health. We're talking about race in the United States and the world and people's identities. <laughs> I feel very thankful that I'm able to have this, like, this kind of dialogue and discussion with you all. This is really sweet. I think that if we can encourage more spaces like this on the internet, especially in a time like this where we're all so isolated, to be able to talk about, you know, like, bringing people together, even though we're all so separated and very far apart, it's a good thing we can do. Maya, what was it like starring in the film Megamind? You know, they painted this whole thing blue for me. It took a really long time because there's a lot of square footage to cover. But it was good. I had a good time. I went to shul. I mix Hispanic white and I hear the word oh, all the time at school and it makes me angry. But I passed as white so nobody men- remembers. I'll get offended by it. But I'm lucky to have good friends at my school that help me ignore everyone else. You just have to know that people are, will not always be kind, and that is so frustrating, and you can fight their ignorance with hate, but the best thing you can do is, I don't know. Everyone's definition of how they can help a situation is totally based off of what they choose to do. For me, the way that I address hate is by making music about it, or writing songs to hopefully reach out to people that are also experiencing it. Was I in a talk about commercial? Yes. I am a ta- in a talk about commercial. They cut out my one line. I was really sad about it. Do you have any coping skills that are willing to share that help you with anxiety and depression and all that fun stuff? Um, let me see. One second. 
I, uh, I would say, <laughs> probably TMI. I had a panic attack a couple days ago at like five in the morning. No one was awake. So one of my grounding techniques, I haven't had one of those happen in a very long time. One of my grounding techniques is hitting my face with cold water or just slapping myself, no, or mm. opening a window and just like letting cold air wash over you. And that helps me just feel more grounded in reality. So if you can find something that feels like that for you, I saw some video of this guy who was using Sour Patch Kids or like an airhead or I think maybe it was like toxic waste candy or something that's like so sour that it actually brings you back into your mind a little bit more because I know I know exactly the feeling when you're anxious it feels like you're drowning you can't breathe you have a really hard time remembering it and I sometimes can disassociate when I get anxious so it looks like you're watching yourself go through this and it's really it's really hard so finding things that are specific to you that feel like they bring you back into your mind a little bit more um that's what I would suggest. And sometimes that takes trial and error, but just to be patient with yourself. It was a lemon. I think that there, it's, it's, there's, lemons are used a lot of times, but yeah. Maya, what's it like being in the hype house? It's really good. It's, it's fine, I guess. That guy with the big eyebrows forces you to make videos all the time. He's also really mean to Addison and Charlie. That's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> ah. hmm. thank you for being so open and genuine about mental health issues on such a large platform you're the voice that i didn't know i needed and you're such an inspiration to me oh well thank you kiera i'm glad i have like i feel you know those are the types of messages that make me under like remember that even though it's hard to open up and the people that will say it's an attention grab are, it's not true. It's like, I, even if one person feels like they're being understood, that's enough reason for me to do this. seems like some of your songs are written about specific people have these people heard your songs what can you tell us while respecting everyone's privacy um yes one of the people has heard the songs and i share them with him but uh that's a great question for a lot of the other songs i embellish details and i think i switch things around a little bit so that way i can write a song that feels like it's removed enough from my own experience to be able to share it with the world so like things like cliche I don't know if that guy has heard that song. I think he has, but I don't think he knows it's about him because I changed it up a little bit more. And then I don't think that one of the, I don't think any of them know except for the one that currently I write songs about knows <laughs> or they know that I have. I think that, <laughs> um, yeah, I think that some of them do know, but they don't talk to me about it. It's like that awkward thing where I'll go, I'm still in touch with a lot of them, and I'm very good friends with most of them. The romantic subjects of <laughs> my songs. <laughs> and uh, it's like that awkward thing where you go hang out with them, and they are like, wow, your music's been really good. And earlier on, when there wasn't much time between writing those songs and releasing them and then hanging out with this person, they were like, yeah, I really like this one. I was like, thanks. And it was about him. <laughs> oh my god. So awkward. Ah, man. Do you ever have a time where you didn't have any friends that you were comfortable with? Yeah. I actually, I'll tell you guys a personal story about high school and that experience for me. Um, it was sophomore year, and 
my group of friends was really into partying and that was never something that I really liked doing and they really liked doing drugs and partaking in other extracurriculars <laughs> that high school students would do sometimes and that's not a bad thing I think high school is a time for people to explore and understand their limits and what they like to do as people but I just wasn't into it and so I just kind of separated myself I distanced themself myself a little bit more from them I'm still really good friends with them because they are lovely lovely people but yeah I I stepped away a little bit and at that point in time I really didn't have any other friends my my um my friend group with them was so insular and we didn't really hang out with anybody else and I wasn't going to parties so it wasn't like I was connecting with other people but hmm. what is this ah. oh my family's texting but I didn't really have any other friends like at that point and so I would just walk around during lunch and I had one best friend from middle school, Anna, who you all probably talked to earlier in this stream. Um, and I stayed connected with her, and we've been best friends since then. But it was really hard being in school during the day and not knowing where to go. Like, during lunch periods, I would just get my lunch, eat it next to the band room on a bench, and then I would go and do homework to fill the rest of the time. And so it was, it was really difficult. And I eventually signed up for things just to fill my time with brief periods. So I would go and I was an admissions intern for my school. I became a part of Asia Club. I did all these different things just to fill the void of not knowing what to do. And so that eventually helped me reach out to people that I, I really like taking out with. And now I have a, a lot more close friends than I ever thought I would have. But it took me time. I think it was like a six month period where I just was, I felt like I was just drifting. So that was hard. But, yeah. All that to say, it can be hard in the moments where you don't have your people, but when they do come along, it's that much nicer. Yeah. I try to get all my non-Asian friends to join my school's Asian club. <laughs> I loved going to Asia Club and there were a ton of non-Asian people that were actually in Asia Club but it was just this nice place where it felt like I you know I went to school in San Francisco and so there were a ton of other kids that were actually mixed race but um so it was nice it didn't feel like it was alienating for me to be there were you ever cheated on if so what happened it's okay if you're not okay talking about it I have not really been in a serious relationship until the my boyfriend currently, but um, I have gotten played by a couple people. That's all I'll say. My school's Asian club president was a white guy. Everybody liked. Oh my god, huge F. Oh my god, what? That's so bad. I, I'm i all for allyship, but that's a little too much. <laughs> what is it? Like, who, what does he do in Asia Club? <laughs> the GSA club president was a straight girl. Oh my gosh. I am so sorry, everybody. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so many f's my ex left me for my, her ex after she told me not to worry about her Oof. we have all been absolutely played by people around us i'm so sorry what is asia club i'm so out of the loop asia club is basically so like do you if you know like like i don't know does i uh, we had school lunch clubs and is that, I feel like that's pretty standard across the board for a lot of different schools, but maybe it's not. And so Asia Club was just, like, the place where Asians gathered in my school. <laughs> and we celebrated our culture. My school is a 6% diversity rate. Oh, I'm so sorry. You are so brave. I go to a small school, so I don't have a lot of these clubs. They just have basics, and now I feel like I'm missing out. You're definitely not missing out. I mean... 
that's a perpetual feeling you will feel whenever you go and do anything in the world. You are just having your own experience. That's not missing out. Everyone's own experience is different. Don't feel bad. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Huh. Maya, have you ever had to lose your friend group? Yes. That was a story I just had about high school. I lost my friend group. Yeah. I also moved schools when I was 10 to go to school somewhere else for fifth grade. And that was really hard. Even though I was young, it was really hard for me to think about leaving my friend group and trying to start fresh in a new place. Even when you're 10 years old, that experience is really hard. Hmm. Mixed, being mixed race is very hard indeed. The audacity of the caucasity. Logic about to be mad when he sees the stream. I know, Logic wishes he could, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I like Logic, he's not that bad. SF Bay Area. I like both for different reasons. I'm a sim for people who aren't good for me. Oh man, girl, you gotta raise that bar. Bro, when people call Africa a country, like Maya. Oh no, no, like, like, dude, go look at a map. I learned that Africa was a country all the way back in fifth grade. When we were learning about, or sorry, I learned that Africa wasn't a country all the way back in fifth grade. When we were learning about what was a country. And I can't believe that there are people that really like to generalize that much about places in the world. Oh, it's Trans Day of Visibility. That's so fun. That's so fun. That's amazing. I, you know, places like Twitter can be a hellhole sometimes, but I also really like how it celebrates, like, people can do the hashtags and stuff, so that way they can talk about, you know, their experiences and showcase themselves and, show, you know, have photos about being proud of who they are and what they look like. That's freaking awesome. I love Twitter. Happy Trans Day of Visibility! Everyone is valid! You're valid! Never forget that. Don't forget about it. Ultimately, that was, that was what I was accidentally playing. Ultimately by Kai. Dreams! Oh, man. My, what do you think about people joining the athletic communities like a bouldering gym or jujitsu to make friends? I think that's so smart. I am very nervous to do those types of things. I've never been very good at putting myself into social situations. Um, I think that's probably because I deal with some social awkwardness in my real life. Um, I've always been better at doing things like the internet and talking on the internet so yeah i think it's really it's great if people can do that i i tried to muster up the courage to sign up for a pottery class for two months and i didn't do it so <laughs> i'm working on it <laughs> oh my gosh mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How many? What did we get to? I think I'm gonna have to sign off so I can go and feed my. <gasps> oh, F. I ordered a gaming PC to my apartment in New York and it just got there. But I probably won't be able to, to have it for another month. So sad. So sad. But that means I can stream when I go back to New York. New York. 
and let's see, let's see, where did we end up on? Ha 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 Ooh, we got to 11,608. No, no, not 11,600. 11,068! 11,000! Ooh, that riff, riff queen. Riff, riff queen. Specs, please? Oh, it's different. It's not as intense as this gaming PC. I got a mini, mini mech. Um, I, it was a pre-built one, but I will post specs when I'm on that PC. But for now, all of my specs are accurate. And so it is okay for now. But thank you everybody for tuning in today. <laughs> Never gets old. Still entertaining every single time I make that pun. Um, but yeah, I really appreciate it. Doing the sorts of streams have been really, really fun. I think today has been a highlight in my own personal experience of Twitch streaming. We did a lot of things and... I am also really happy that I was able to talk about things that are not so lightheart, lighthearted or, or easy to talk about. I think, like, as a person who enjoys being able to express her opinions, it's really nice when I'm able to do that with other people. And being in quarantine, it's not easy to have discussions with people like that all the time. So thank you all for letting me have the space to talk and for also engaging me and, and telling me and sharing your story. So thank you. Um, but yeah, I'm really excited. I'm going to be back here on Friday, so I get two days off of more working on other things behind the scene um but yeah i will see you all on friday i think we'll probably play more animal crossing we'll have to use the fake counter again next time and redeem that so we'll figure it out um but yes or we'll play some more just dance there's lots of options i think we're gonna have to do some music though too I'll, I'll sing for you all next time have a have a request for a song that you would like to hear me sing ready by friday and i will i will try and learn them on the spot but yeah. All right. Thank you guys so much. I will talk to you soon and I'll see you on the next stream. Goodbye, laddies. <laughs>